Good evening, everyone. I'm glad you're here. Thank you very much for joining me. Those of you uh, northeast of Reno, Nevada, Spanish Springs. Yeah, you're having another earthquake swarm. Um, there's been 46 earthquakes within that location within the last month. And the last week, there's been 32. And today, you've had six. This is probably the fourth time this year that you've had a swarm of earthquakes in that location. The largest was uh, today, or for today, it wasn't the largest that you've had this month, but the largest for today is a magnitude 3.0. 92 people said they felt it. It was only about 6.2 miles in depth, and USGS gave it an intensity level of 3. There was one report sent in today to EMSC. They said it was a quick, rough shake. And that came from Sparks, Nevada. Going to Google Earth, here's the location of today's swarm. Um, you are capable of having a magnitude 5 or larger. The largest earthquake uh, for Nevada was in 1915, I believe. And that was a magnitude 7.3. It was near Winnemucca, Nevada. I've been there. Yeah, out in the desert. Swarms of earthquakes could be an indication that a larger one is coming, but not always the case. I hope you guys are prepared. Yeah, there's fault lines that go up through here. Um, Nevada is the third most um, shaking state in the country. I guess you could say that. So intensity level three means it was felt noticeably indoors, but not always recognized as an earthquake. Standing autos rock slightly, vibration like a passing truck. The farthest report looks like it came from the south, down there by Glen Rock, or Glen Rook, excuse me, Glen Rook, um, by Lake Tahoe. They said it was an intensity level 2. Interesting. But uh, Sun Valley, Intensity Level 3, Reno, Intensity Level 3, um, Sparks, Nevada, Intensity Level 3. There is quite a few homes, a large population close to where these earthquakes are occurring. So I would like to know, um, how did your pet react? Uh, did you feel dizziness um, during the earthquake or prior to it or afterwards? And did you have anything fall off the shelves or noticing uh, chandeliers or lights swaying? What did the motion feel like? Was it east to west, north to south? Was it oscillating? Yeah, put all that information down below, please. And I certainly hope everyone is earthquake prepared. Yeah, um, fives are probably very probable for this location. Always be prepared. Please stay safe. Thank you very much, and please share, and I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye. -bye.